Hey, what is up guys? My name is Al from Wanda Tech. Welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're going to talk about how you can use more than two headphones at the same time. Doesn't just include headphones. Of course, that includes earphones, headphones, wireless pods, speakers, and everything in between. As long as it is an audio output device, it would work. Of course, the first thing that I would tell you is if you want something that is super cheap and super easy to do, you can just buy one of these, which is kind of like an audio output splitter. You can just plug in how many headphones, earphones whatsoever, it would just work. But we are talking more about flexibility today. And of course, we wanna do it software wise and also for free. All right, so right now we are on my desktop and I have three things connected right now. I got my headphones right here. I got the AirPods and of course my IEMs connected. So I wanna use all three of them at the same time. Outputs everything at the same time. Now, by the way, I already created a video about this. I use SteelSeries Sonar GG. That one is much easier to use, free, also no latency, plus you have more flexibility and power with your audio levels per program, per headphones or per audio output device. Then again, this one is lighter on your system. So let's talk about a software that we're gonna be using. In today's video, we'll be taking a look at voice meter. Now there's three different kind of like versions of the software, standard one, banana and potato. And to quickly tell you what are the difference between them, there you go, difference between voice meter, banana and potato. Standard offers two physical, one virtual output, voice meter, banana, three physical inputs, two virtual output, Voice meter potato offers five physical and three virtual ones. So let us go with voice meter potato. Let's click on download. All right, once that is downloaded, we have this zip file right here. What we do is, of course, we just extract the file, press OK. Once again, I downloaded voice meter potato, which allows me to input more headphones, if that makes sense. So we're just going to install it right here. Run as admin. This would pop up, just press install. It would also install a driver. So my audio may cut off or I might not hear anything. So let's give it a few moments. All right, once the installation is installed, this would pop up. You must reboot your system to finalize installation. So I'll reboot real quick. All right, once you restart your computer, you can just go ahead and search for voice meter on your start menu. You cannot see mine right now, but it shows me voice meter, voice meter, banana, and potato. I'm just going to open up voice meter, potato, x64, which ensures I'm a 64 bit. And then this is what we got right here. We got five inputs five outputs. Now I know for some of you, this is like, there's so much happening on my screen and I don't know what to do. Well, it is as easy as one, two, three. So let's first set out hardware out. Once again, I have three devices connected. My HyperX through USB, a USB dongle, my AirPods Pro, and then the IEMs that I have. So what we're going to do here is on hardware out, we want to select those specifically. So select out what we're gonna do here, keep it at WDM. You can mess around with either WDM or MME, but we're just gonna keep it simple with WDM. So right here, I'm gonna first select my, let's select my AirPods first. Right here, let's select my speakers, HyperX, Cloud of Light, my earphones right here, and even add one more, my monitor speakers, which is right here. Those are my four outputs right now. I can add even one more if I really want to, but I don't really have anything else. So we're just going to keep it that way. Now, after you set everything, you're probably going to go ahead and go to YouTube and start playing a video and you don't hear anything. Of course, you guys won't hear anything because I only have my microphone as set to record, but I can't hear anything as well. Now, how do we fix that? On voice meter input right here, if you only see two or one, doesn't matter. As long as it's called voice meter input, we just have to select everything, one to five. Now I still won't hear anything because what I have to do is head over to Windows Sound Mixer. So on start menu right now, I'm typing sound, going to the sound mixer option, and this window would pop up. Output device is currently set to Steel Series Sonar Gaming because that's what I use, Steel Series. But if I click on that, if I scroll down just a tad bit, see the voice aux input right here or voice meter aux input, all I gotta do is press on that. Boom, that's my device right now. And that is this input right here. Now I myself forgot into some technical difficulties because I am still using SteelSeries GG. So I actually don't advise you using this SteelSeries software with a voice meter 
um, but I have to actually select it here, the personal mix into the aux input. But with all that done, all I gotta do now is click play. And I can hear myself, as you can see, they're all popping up here. Let me also pop in my AirPods. I can hear it. And let me also go and pop in my HyperX headphones. Damn, headphoneception. Turn it on. I can also hear it right here. Damn, that's kind of trippy. I can, I can hear everything on different kind of wavelength because they have different sound profiles per audio output device that i got there but um yeah that is basically how to use voice meter as kind of like your device and um yeah that is about it thank you so much guys for watching this video if this video did help you don't forget to of course like share with your friends because they might need it especially in the future all right and now you can also comment down in the comment section below if you do have any specific questions about this video or my other videos or whatever life or in general i guess check out my socials at a1en avila check out the personal socials of this actual youtube channel at one.tech and um yeah thanks so much guys for watching and i will see you guys in the next video have a nice day.